Series of the week time. Base winner, we've got the Red Sox and the Yankees. On Friday, we've got Tanner Houck and Nestor Cortez. On Saturday, Josh Winkowski, Garrett Cole. Sunday, Cutter Crawford, Luis Heal. What do you think about the series of the week? The most famous the most famous rivalry in all of sports, Red Sox-Yankees. Yeah, the Yankees have certainly fallen upon hard times recently. But uh, taking a look at this series, it starts tomorrow. And just to kind of give you what you got to do to win the series, well, you got to win the first two out of the three games. So in this case, it's a three-game series. And we'll take a look at the Friday night game, Tanner Houck versus Nestor Cortez. I've got this game priced at minus 106. And then we'll go, because it is, we do need to do this really quickly. Uh, we'll go to Saturday's game. And I got Winkowski for Red Sox against Garrett Cole. I'm still sold on Cole. I, I think that he's... He's got huge upside, obviously. Uh, he's 15th in the base winner uh, ratings. I've got the Yankees priced as a heavy favorite in this one, minus 241. And then we'll go to the Sunday game. The Sunday game features Cutter Crawford versus Luis Heel. I've got that game priced at minus 112. Uh, gives you an aggregate of uh, 0.583%. Uh, and then if you put it in the binomial calculator, I think this game should be priced Yankees, or the series rather, should be priced at Yankees minus 165, Kyle. Yeah, I agree. And uh, Luis Heal, you expect, you know, it's been a little bit rough for him. You sort of hit that rookie wall. Uh, but as I look at Cole and Heal on Saturday and Sunday, I sort of lean Yankees here. Thoughts on this, Corby, quickly? Oh, the mute, the mute monster got me. Jesus. Uh, mm -hmm. I, I would I would say uh, Yankees favorite in two or three. Um, I don't have the series price in front of me. I would assume Yankees minus 140. Uh, this is based on what I'm saying. Also, I'm dialed in. I'm getting texts from the, the, oh, every single person. It's, it's, uh, it's on. Yeah. Seriously, it's on. Are, you, are, cool. you getting, are you getting butterflies in your stomach? I swear to God, I am. I'm not even joking. I really I'm am. A little, I'm a little nervous. Uh, these hot dogs I are getting too. a little bigger. Every time I look down, the hot dogs are starting to roll on the plate. See, you guys have fresh cooks. Mine are getting cold. You know? I had my, butler, I had my butler service bring them out. I'm sure Base Runner had uh, Corbin Burns bring his. So he's probably chilling. <laughs> uh, people didn't Corbin factor Burns. that into account. So also the warmth. Of Arizona, I'm sure. I'm sure he's in a better spot than people give him credit for. Yeah, B Dub called. He says, "Kyle, I have a problem. They don't sell lowly products like Nathan's hot dogs at the place that I shop. I'm shopping with Corbin Burns and the gals from, you know, uh, what is it, the Real Housewives of Scottsdale. I don't have time for. I can't be going to Albertsons. What if people see me? Uh, Kenny, on this series of the week, uh, what do you think here, Yankees, Red Sox? Uh, yeah, I agree with what Corby said completely. I, I, I have nothing else to add. I'm ready to eat some dogs. Done. That is beautiful. B Dub, did you did you want to uh, respond to your uh, uh, your fancy shopping habits? No, you're right, man. There's some really good stores here, and there's some some really good housewives <laughs> here. I, I agree with you. Yeah. <laughs> there we go. Okay, now it is time. It is the time we've all been waiting for. If we could at least get everyone to hit the like button, we certainly appreciate that. Here at BetUS TV, let us get re ready for this. Joey Chestnut drops out of the hot dog eating contest. Our political landscape is in disarray. Divisions on both sides. America needs a hero to che cheer for. And who better than America's favorite sports book? Bet